What's up guys, Ankle Spankin here, and today we are playing as Lucian the Purifier. Lucian is not an item, Longsword is though, so let's go ahead and pick up the Longsword and three health potions, and don't forget our trinket of course. And, in this rank game, um, hopefully, we'll be better than my last ones, because it's starting to get a little old, but we'll see, we'll see, we'll do our best and just focus on ourselves, practice our own skills. And I know I did make a Lucian video recently, but I do find him very fun, and I do want to get better with him so with that said let us go on with this game it looks like we are with the Tarek support and I forgot to get the Targans okay I forgot to get the Targan thing damn Tarek does a lot of damage on that shot I'll I'll do it after wait can I use it whatever no I can't I left the item shop. I'll do it on my next back. Um, because Targans is freaking OP. I'll get it on my next back, depending on how well we do. It's better than Dorns. Now after a nerf. But anyways. Let's go on with this. I do want to explain that. Um, it depends on how this lane goes. Like you said, if it's passive, I'll get the Targans. If it's not, then I won't. But, anyways... Uh, actually, the longsword and three potions. Personally, it's I, I found it to be preference, but I like it more because it doesn't set me behind at all with having to have a Doran's item. And it's actually effectively like better, depending on how it is, because you actually get more damage out of it. You lose a bit of health, and you lose that three health on back, or health gain when you uh, when you hit something. Whoops, I hit the wrong guy. But uh, it is more damage, and you can also get three potions with it now instead of uh, just two. So... I've been experimenting with it a little bit, and I like it. Plus, like I said, it doesn't set me back uh, at all. Where a Doran's Blade, you know, you're eventually going to sell it. It'll set you back a little bit. Let's see, is Terry going to pick up that one? He will. Is he going to get this one too? He will. And the Targans is freaking hecka crazy OP, just in case you guys were wondering. There's some good damage off on her. That'll be a bunch of damage off onto that Janna. Let's see what we can do with that. So, I did quite a lot of good damage off on her. Let's try not to get poked. She did just cancel two autos, which would have harassed us some. So that's good for us. Let's just keep it kind of passive. She does have her W first, so I'm not really afraid of any piltover over peacemakers or anything like that. And I do have Tarek, who is hecka OP. And pretty much all you do with the Targans, if you don't know, is you, um... You basically just jack CS. Because it makes it so... Oh god, oh god, I'm gonna miss those. No, stop. Please, I just want the CS's. I just want the baby CS's. Alright, I'm gonna get them. And I'm gonna get them like that. Bow! There we go. Got both those CS and I did some poke to Janna too. So that'll be some good CS for us. Dropping his warden there. I'm just gonna chill in the back and keep CSing. But anyways, as I was trying to say, the Targon's what it does. And good job. But it makes it so you get these little blue orbs around you, and basically that means when a minion is low, you can run up and execute it. If it's lower than 200 health, you can execute it, and it will heal me for a bit of my health. And then I will also get the uh, the gold that he got out of it. So we both get the CS plus, um, like if he gets the CS, I'll get the CS gold plus 5 for uh, for the level 1 item. When it gets to the level 2 item, I get the CS gold plus 10. So it gets pretty good. Let's go ahead and, oh, he did pick up that one with the targets. I'm going to sit here, I'm going to grab these traps real fast just because I don't want them here uh, they will kind of kind of affect our mobility later and it's kind of awkward because Targans makes you look like you're falling behind in CS sometimes but you're actually ahead on gold if you if your support CS matches your CS or matches or supports and combination of your CS matches their AD carry CS so it's kinda of weird but ooh that'll be some damage off of me let's get our first potion ticking Oh yeah, also I forgot when your support gets a CS2, uh, he heals. Or it heals you for like, some percent of your maximum health or something like that. It's pretty good. And it looks like Riven, oh they did trade kills. So Mundo picking up a kill on Riven, but Riven also dying. So not too terrible. But, it definitely could have gone better. It is 2-2 two two right now, so things are going okay. I'm actually ahead of Caitlyn's CS. Plus my support has a Targans, where I think Janna actually does have one too, so... Never mind, we're about, we're pretty equal. Target, Terra's gonna get that one, so that's fine. 
and let's see, you gonna go ahead and pick up this CS, is Tarek gonna, I think Tarek should get this one too, so I'm just gonna ping it, so he knows to run over here and execute it, Tarek, oh he doesn't have, oh god, I'm gonna, yeah I missed that one, I thought he had a stack, he totally didn't, uh, it looks like I just missed, alright, Dr. Mundo coming in, oh there's Mundo right there right now, now let's see, the stun not coming in, maybe, is the stun coming in, like I don't know, oh, Targan's picking up that one, I'm really, I'm having a hard time actually getting used to that, to be totally honest with you. And I, I just can't shake this feeling that they know that Mundo's here. Who knows? We'll see. We'll see, though, here in just a moment. And they totally did know that Mundo was here. <laughs> so, Mundo is just going to dip out of here after that, after that little awkwardness. And let's just keep up the CS in. Derek going to pick that one with the targets. Going to shoot that twice so it'll be low enough that I can get after it hits the tower. And pick up this one. Tarek will help me a little bit, and I actually feel like after we get, oh, that sucks, but after we get a little bit further into this lane, uh, we will start winning it pretty hard, because Tarek is really strong burst, and it looks like we're going for a lot of damage off on her right now, there's some good poke, and this will hurt me some, but I can't, can't let this stop me, I can't let that stop me, man, I can't let that stop me, man, you going down, bitch, you going down, bitch. All right, there goes Janna's exhaust, and let's see if we can do some good damage here. I'm going to get my potions popping. I am out of mana, so that was pretty good for us. We got her exhaust down, so that was definitely good for us. And, boop. Oh, I missed that one. Shit. Wait, I think, yeah, Tarek didn't have any target sticks, so, bam, there we go. And I'm just going to go back on that. Tarek and I both had the same thing in mind. I was accidentally pinging. But since we are pretty bloodthirsty this uh, lane, I am going to get the fag because I'm just going to rush the, uh, whatever it's called, the, yeah, what's it fucking called? The Trinity, Ed Trinity, Trinity Force, Trinity Edge? Trinity Force, but I'm going to pick up a lot of potions and a mana potion so we can get back there. And eat her poke, she's probably going to have a BS sword. Never mind, she picked up double Doran, so she's even further behind me right now. And then she picked up her Vamp Scepter. Uh, I might pick up a Vamp Scepter on my next back, actually, if I don't have enough for Sheen. Because in the lane that they are, they'll be poking us a lot. And I would rather not get poked out when I can afford not to. But anyways, let's see. She's a 33 CS, I am at 40. I have a huge wave coming towards me as well. And obviously the gold from Tarek's Targans is helping me as well. So it looks like I'm gonna let him. We're gonna let him get the siege minion. So you get siege. There we go. Just so he knows, and then bam, get that siege for us. Let's see. Was he able to upgrade it? He did not upgrade it. He picked up the sight stone instead, which is fine. But the sight stone is actually a little iffy right now because it makes it like you can only have three. Um, three wards out at once so it's kind of oh I missed that one that was bad I'm gonna miss that one too god this sucks help oh my god I'm too strong alright good Tarek picked up one with the targets I messed that up pretty badly but let's see she does not have she actually has just barely more damage than us but since I am Lucian I am heck OP so I'm stronger than she is I'm gonna run up here and ward this real fast whoa he's going in just gonna ward that bush though with my little wardy thing I'm gonna go ahead and dash out of here. I just ate a lot of poke, and that was bad for me. Terry picking that up with the Targans. Let's see. It looks like Zeg coming in right here. Gonna... Gonna stun? Alright, there's the stun, and let's see. Is Zeg gonna go in? No, but Caitlyn has no flash now. So I'm gonna take a lot of damage. I don't know... I'm I'm kinda guessing Terex's stun wasn't, on, wasn't off cooldown yet, but that's all I can really think of. Let's see. We do know Caitlyn has no flash now, at least. So that's good for us. And whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, just doing some poke. Just doing some poke. We good. Boop. Boop. Is he gonna get this one? Yeah, he is going to get that one. That'll heal me as well. Heal me. That'll heal me as well. Let's see. Tarek eating a biscuit. Making that absolutely disgusting ass noise. And let's see. He does not have any any target and stuff, so he's not going to be able to jack any CS. Get back, we're getting ganked. And let's see. I'm pretty sure... Is he trying to bait? Okay, never mind. We're not getting ganked. She's gone. This is good. But Mundo's here for us. So let's see if we can do anything. The scrying or the 
lens thing coming out. Go use the calling immediately. It looks like here's a lot of damage going off, and we are not going to do anything with this, I don't think. Unless, oh, Mundo wants it, and Mundo will tank it, so that will be a kill for me. Let's go ahead and shoot the Ardent Blaze over here, and she will die. That will be a double kill for the Lucian. Great, great job, Mundo. Let's go ahead and run around here as fast as we can so Riven can't catch us. It's supposed to be at 2-0, and, oh, and pretty strong. We might be able to, if we all turned on her, I think we could have killed her. But we are not going to. We're going to take the safe route and just go back. Actually, I feel like I should have pushed that first. But, you know, things happen. Let's go ahead and get the sheen and get some health potions again and a mana potion. Tons, 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 tons of uh, gold spell and potions. But since she does have two Dorns and I have two kills now, I am very, very strong. So, <clears throat> very far ahead of the enemy Caitlyn. Let's go ahead and do these real fast, because this will help me out a little. And we should be good. I'm going to go ahead and pick up that one. Mundo is tanking it for me like the nice guy he is. Thanks, Mundo. You're a great pal. Oh, Mundo picking it up. That's okay. <laughs> Whoops. Whatever. Still help me out a little bit. Looks like they are freezing. This is exactly why I should have shoved it. Because now they can freeze right here. I have to run up here and poke them out so they stop freezing it. Knock that shit off. Whoa, whoa, okay, wow, she is weak. She is weak. I like that. Alright, that bush is warded, so that is fine. But now, we can be abusive to them. Oh wait, this is warded, so I'm not going to find, I'm not going to seek safety in that bush uh, against her vision, so. Go ahead and just do a bunch of damage to her here. That'll be some decent damage here. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Really, really, no, come on. Not, not, not now. I'm just going to launch the Cullen, and that will be a bunch of damage going off on her. And let's see if we can potentially do something here. Because I know I have my Flash. If Terra can get a stun off, that'll be good. There's the Targans. And let's see, I'm going to go ahead and launch the Q nailing her with it, actually. That was good. And we are ahead of them right now. It looks like Tarek wants to dive. And that, yeah, he changed his mind at the right time. So now we're not going to do that for sure. Looks like Riven picking up a kill. Zed going to kill Katarina though, that's for sure. So Riven's getting pretty big. That is not good for us. If Terry gets a stun, we might be able to kill him. Uh, hopefully Mundo just gets to that big monster point where he's just so invincible that it doesn't even matter. And then we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. Let's uh, boop. just keep getting the CS and keep hopefully dominating our lane. I'm going to run over here and work that real fast. It looks like Tarek really wants to kill them with good reason too because we are pretty strong. Uh, let's see, he's going to get that one with the targets. That'll be fine. And whoops, I didn't even mean to shoot that one. But that's fine. We are getting very close to the Trinity Force, so that will help us a lot too. Let's go ahead and just do some damage to her. Just going to go ahead and use my E to get out of there. I ate some unnecessary poke. Uh, I thought I was in range to use my Q, but I was not. That was a mistake. And Caitlyn was able to sustain up just fine. It looks like Mundo's coming in for another gank. So we're just going to try and, you know, try and be somewhat passive and something like that. So at least maybe we... Oh, fuck. I thought I'd do a lot more damage. The thing with ganking is that you can't look like you've got your... Uh, your jungler there, because if you look like you got your jungler there, people aren't going to fall for it. And the lane is pushing towards us now, because she queued, so this is looking good for us. Now let's go ahead and just drop this here. The Targon's giving it away, but we have to see the flash coming out from her, and this will be the Janna ultimate, and we will be getting out of here. Not going to die this one. So there goes Caitlyn's flash, that's good to know. Now let's go ahead and just keep up the CS, and I should be able to get that one just fine, and this one. So we should be good. Looks like he wants to go back. Yeah, let's go back, because I can get my Trinity Force. I'm not going to be able to back here. <laughs> Fuck. Whatever. I'm going to push this out. There we go. Now we'll go back. And it looks like there's a big fight going out on mid again. Never mind. Just, just a standard size fight. Let's see, we are still ahead of Caitlyn and CS, got two kills on her. Uh, my Tarek is behind Jen on CS a little bit, but, you know, that's pretty irrelevant to be totally honest with you. But now we have the Trinity, f I keep wanting to call it Trinity Edge, I don't know why. 
We have the Triforce. So we are getting pretty strong. Our team is actually ahead right now. On, uh, on kills at least. And it looks like we're ahead in CS all around the board. So that is good for us. And... Good. good. I'm going to actually grab these real fast. Annie picking up a kill on the Singe. Great job, Annie. And that will keep her a bit ahead of this Singe. Singe is currently 0-3. So that's definitely good for us, but Riven is getting very big, just constantly killing the Zed who is 1 and 4. But hopefully, since it is Zed, he should still be able to do just fine uh, once he gets a little later into the game. We'll see how this goes. And I'm going to miss that CS now because I'm freaking garbage. Did she get a BF Sword yet? She did get a BF Sword. So she's a bit stronger, I'm a bit stronger. We'll see how it goes. The Targon's coming out. Use that one too. And now that he's got the upgrade version, it will give me 10 additional gold instead of just, uh, instead of just however much it did before, 5. And he also gets 4 charges of it instead of only 2. Looks like the stun coming out, gonna do some big poke to her. Definitely worth it for me, because I do have sustained support. And, uh, I've also got my, uh, my potions. Whoops. Dive? Already? Oh, Mundo's here, okay. The stun coming out, let's see if we can do something here. Terrace got the tower. And let's go ahead and just use the Ardent Blazon here, and this will be one kill. Let's go ahead and Q for that kill, and pew 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 Use that, and Riven's coming in. Don't think she'll try and kill us, though. So that will put me at 3-0-1, and, and we may be able to get this tower. So let's go. I'm going to go ahead and Q that, just get low enough for Terra to target it. And we will definitely take this tower. That will be very good for us. And... Let's go ahead and just push this wave out and then go back again. I'm going to go ahead and Ardent Blaze those two minions and go back. Wait, nope. He wants to do the dragon real fast. I am definitely down for that. Looks like Zed is getting chased. The flash coming out. Is Katarina going to catch up? Let's go ahead and get over to him. Looks like we are not even trying to kill Katarina. Let's go ahead and pick up this dragon. Holy fuck, we did that fast. And Singe is proxy farming. Interesting. All right, so we picked up the dragon, picked up the bot tower. Annie is just going to walk around over here. So maybe, is she going to do some hella crazy damage to Singed? Let's let's see it, Annie. Come on, let's see it. She's not even going to get in range. So she's just running into this poison right now. Kind of being a, uh, a silly goose, if you will. Let's go ahead and pick up the BF sword. Because I do have a lot of money, and I'll just pick up a mana potion and dash out of here and run up there. Looks like Mundo is coming up to stop the proxy in right now. So, that could be good. Annie, not going to use her stun, actually. Oh, wait, she doesn't have it. The stun, not coming out still, but that will definitely be a kill off on this singed, unless... Nope. 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 Riven is going to destroy them. Maybe. Never mind. Annie is murdering her. And if Tibbers can get in there, Mundo picking it up with the cleaver, or the trophy, I guess you could say, because it's TPA Mundo. Great job, team. And this is starting to look good for us. Let's go ahead and just Arden Blaze this wave. And Terra gonna get that with the Targons. Gonna get that one with the Targons. Gonna get that one with the Targons. And I actually will just use the Cullen on this wave to kind of clear it faster. Yep. And that will clear that wave immediately. So you can push really hard. I'm gonna ward this push with my ward. And this will get us pushed up. Hopefully attracting some attention maybe of their jungler. Uh, allowing the other lanes some relief. And also, it could potentially bring the mid lane over here, too. So, possibly able to push mid out of it. The stun coming out, and this will be a... Holy god damn, that'll be a bunch of damage off on her. Riven coming down, but she will not get to us. Let's go ahead and get my mana potion. One of my health potions popping, popping. And let's see, the vision ward coming out in there. Mundo picking up the mid tower. Singed, getting killed by our Zed. Now let's go ahead and just shoot my W in there. Janna's still sitting in there. And the stun coming out, but let's go ahead and just get this Vision Ward real fast. So the Vision Ward's gone. There goes their money. It's Targon's, Targon's going to pick up those minions. And not going to pick up that one. Does he have any stacks? Get out of here. Riven's here. So we're just going to back on out of here before Riven decides she wants to kill us. And keep up the pushing. Let's see, 128 to 107, and Tarek's still doing quite a lot for us. Let's go ahead and just dash in here and do a bunch of damage to her. The stun coming out, and this 
might be a kill. Looks like Tarek's getting the kill up there. Tarek's got it under control. Tarek totally has that kill. And I just ate a lot of turret shots, so that kind of sucks. And the minions are coming up, so he won't even have to tank the turret. So here comes Tarek. And Tarek's actually beating the fuck out of Janna right now. Let's go ahead and assist him with that. Bam! Oh, shit. Oh, shoot! Oh, shoot! Ah! Bye-bye! Oh, God! Oh, God! That was the worst one ever! Ah! Oh, God! Katarina's here, too! Oh, fuck. I didn't read rough. <laughs> Whoops! I didn't read that. Horribly misplayed on my part. We were too ham. I was trying to help Terex so we could pick up some kills, but we got way too cocky. And sadly, things happen. That will be my first death of the game. Let's go ahead and pick up the Vampire Acceptor and the Berserker Greaves. So now I've got some sustain, so I can only have, I can buy one potion of each. I do like to pick up mana potions on AD carries, because especially the ones that use a lot of mana, of course. Just uh, pretty, for pretty obvious reasons, I think. And it looks like Singe is going to get flipping with that Zed. Zed, probably not going to pick up the skill at all. But Annie is running over there to try and assist her. Um, Zed, you're going to kill yourself, man. That's not good. Yeah, they need to back out, back out, back out. Are they potentially going to kill this Riven? Oh, Annie with the burst! And Zed will pick up that kill. Let's go ahead and kill this lady Janna gonna be running over here I'm not going to let that stop me there's the ardent blaze coming out BAM 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 there's a kill from me and that will be good for us and now Tarek is going to make that Targans do some work I'm hoping and nope he's not I lied let's go ahead and get our mana potion popping and let's see what we're doing here I'm not gonna use my calling on this wave cuz no need to let's see if I can get Tarek to use his thingy though. Tarek, are you using your thingy? No, Tarek's not using the thingy. But we should be able to get this tower. Um, so this is good. This will help us out a lot. And Tarek popping his ultimate for this. Not a terrible idea, because Tarek's ultimate is a very strong aura that gives us AP and damage. So, I'm actually going to back out, because everyone else backed out. Obviously, it's not a good idea to be overextended alone. So let's run over here. And me. Me. Ankle gets the blue. Ankle does not get the blue. Never mind. GG. <laughs> it happens. It's okay. That happens. So, <laughs> I'm bad. Accept it. Looks like Singe is going to be dying again. And Riven coming in over here. Let's see if we can possibly pick up a kill on this Katarina or one of them. Oh, the stun coming out! That will be... Oh, this is a dead Riven! Let's go ahead and pop the calling. Get myself out of there so I'm not in her damage. That will be a kill off on both of them for none of us. And this is great for us. We are currently 5-1-3. and three, Doing some good... Uh, doing some good things. And finally! Finally, I won! I won a game! <laughs> oh, the lost streak is over! The lost streak is over, guys! That was like the first game I've won in like 12 ranked games. This is... That was a miracle! Ah! It was with Lucian too. Lucian is my hero. Oh, I knew Colin Freak would bring me a blessing one day. Anyways, if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you have a like and a favorite. It really helps me out. If you want to, you can follow me on Facebook, Twitter, or Twitch. All three links will be in the description below. And as always, I love you guys. And I hope you all have a wonderful day. Peace!